build the PC for your needs. What are you talking about, right? Well, basically, there are people who want to build their own PC that will go to people who have built PCs in the past for previous people and stuff like that and basically say, well, I want a gaming computer, right? And if the person that has built previous computers in the past does not ask this question, which is, well, what do you mainly want to do on it or what games are you aiming around for to play on? then generally they're just going to expect the person that asked them to help them with a gaming PC build to, you know, they're just going to be like, well, they want to play all the AAA games and stuff like that, etc., right? When a lot of people, believe it or not, a lot of people say, go up and say to people that, and they wind up getting a ridiculously overkill PC for actually what they want to play. There are a ton of people that you can see if you if you look up PC builds and stuff like that, they're only playing Minecraft and they're only playing CSGO but they have 16 gigabytes of RAM, they're running a GTX 980, okay, and they're running an i7. They never use the full potential of that. Their only sole purpose for building that PC was to play Minecraft over 100 frames or CSGO over 100 frames. So they're never really using the full potential of that, right? You can easily run Minecraft or CSGO with a graphics card that's lower price than a GTX 980 you could run it perfectly fine with a 960 and you could run it perfectly fine with an i5 right so when it comes down to it build the PC that best fits your needs and what I mean that is before you start buying all these components and stuff like that sit down and you know be like well what do I mainly want this PC for and a lot of people look at the components that I put in my PC the GTX 750 Ti right and they're just like, well, Ray, why did you buy such a shit graphics card? And my answer to that is, well, my main priority was not gaming on the PC. If I wanted to build a main gaming PC, then I would have put a different graphics card in and all that other stuff, right? My main priority for this was to get a PC that just renders faster, but on the little extra, I can do a little bit of gaming if I want to. I'm not going to be playing AAA titles, right? I'm not going to be playing like Black Ops 3 on it. I'm going to stick to console for my primary, but I wanted to do a little bit of gaming on the side, right? And that's overall what you should be looking at. Don't overspend when you don't need to. Because the thing is, if you're doing a budget build, eventually later on, get that PC built and everything. And if you want to, then you can upgrade to a different graphics card. You see what I'm saying? That's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. And I'll check you guys next time. Peace.